We finished up the shoulder sculpt last time, and now it's time to make a mold. First, I'll be creating the silicone jacket. So I'll take equal parts of the two halves of the material and make sure they're mixed together very thoroughly. Next, I'll take the mixed silicone and start brushing a detail coat over the entire sculpt. After several layers of this, I'll um, then need to create a hard outer shell to support the uh, silicone jacket. In between the layers of the mold, while I was waiting, I also started sculpting the bracer. The process for the bracer is going to be very similar to the shoulder pad. Blocking out big shapes and then slowly refining small details. When the jacket's all done as well, I'm ready to open up the mold and then prepare for casting. For casting this piece, I'm going to be using a urethane resin and I'll be slushing in uh, multiple layers to get it to the thickness that I want it to kind of balance both strength and durability as well as weight. Once I've done all the layers I need and the piece is as thick as I want it, um, it's ready to be demolded so I can pop off the shell, pull off the silicone jacket. After it's all cleaned up, the cast is a one-to-one -one replica of the original sculpt. After this, we're ready to get started into priming and painting, so we'll be jumping into that next. See you soon!